Well, I have quilting and drag racing. Quilting, I got started when I went over to my grandma's house. She was quilting and I went over there and thought it was interesting, so I asked if I could do it. And so I went to get some fabric and I started making, my first quilt was puppy paws. It like bones and stuff and paws. And then drag racing, I started when I was eight years old. So my dad started racing when he, or when he was older. So I used to go to the racetrack a lot and I got interested in that. And so we went to go get my first junior dragster in Buckeye. And I started racing that and now I'm on my fourth car. So I've grown a lot. When Phil went to pick Alex up one day, my mother said he can't go yet because he's not done sewing. And so it's, it, it's actually a very long story, but they, it, we, we tease them about it all the time that, that Phil wasn't quite sure about his son sewing. Um, <laughs> but when we saw the things that he's done, it, it's just amazing. He, um, you know, he needed help at first, and, um, but he's learned how to do his own bindings now. He's learned how to do his paper piecing. Um, he takes his classes, and it, like you saw in his scrapbook, um, his, he, he figures in his mind his own, you know, his designs, and you know, like the one he, he did for the, for the show. Um, he's had more in the show than I have. He came along late and later in Kim's life, and so he's always been kind of special to us, and uh, I was with him a lot when he was really young, and he just seems to enjoy to be with me as much as I enjoy being with him. And um, he picked it up so quickly that I was surprised. And he did take some classes um, then to at the market. And um, now he's into, he loves the paper piecing. Now he wants to start paper piecing. So he, he always wants to go into something different and keep going. And um, I'm happy to have him do that. So I do most of my quilting in the summertime. And when I have winter break like I am on now, I start projects. What are you working on at the moment? I'm working on the uh, race car quilt. It has cars, flames, and all stuff, trying to get the binding on. And I did that in a summer camp that I worked on with my instructors, Miss Kitty. And Miss Susan that work at Quilt the Quilters Market, and they've taught me a lot. I'm happy that people encouraged him at the show to put things in and to try, and uh, you know, a hundred quilts out of the whole state is a fairly a, a very good honor, I think. Phil used to race his car, and uh, I was going out there when I was pregnant. And shortly after Alex was born, we decided we still needed to go out there, so we bought a small motor home and so I could still bathe him and it's fun. It's fun to go out there and you know, we're we're all together. We travel a lot and you know, we take the dogs, we take the grandkids and and then we're all together. So we're all together. We're in, you know, he's not sitting in front of the T V playing video games and you know, not that there's anything wrong with that, but that's not who he is and that he's just not that kind of boy, so it, it's good. No, it's good. He meets a lot of good kids. Um, it's a special group of a special group of, of boys and girls um, that are out there, and they all know that he quilts. And you know, he. I have to say, I don't think anybody has ever teased him. I don't think anybody has ever teased him. They're just in awe of, you know, what what he does. He's made baby quilts for teachers. Um, you know, he made his Grand Canyon quilt that he auctioned off um, as a fundraiser. Next year they go to Disneyland. Is it Disneyland? I think next year the they go to Disneyland. Um, he plans on making a quilt to you know raise money to so that he can go there, and that's his way of of giving back a little bit. Yeah, judging from the first time he went down the track until he won that championship, and you know just three short years later. It, it was really an accomplishment. It was something I tried to do my whole racing career and never got to. And to see him come out and in his third year of racing, you know, he was top dog. 
there's number one qualifier where you get the best reaction time. I have three winner trophies and the Wally, which is the highest trophy you can get. And I was happy about that. And then runner up, have a lot of those. And my big one that I have is about four feet tall. That was when I won track champion for the Southwestern International Raceway. That was exciting.